probably could have. Yeah. Uh, so what about, though, what about the AFC right now? Let's get back to that. The Steelers playing the Titans this week. I think they Listen, should re- Let me tell you how the AFC playoffs is going to go. All right. Number one seed will be Pittsburgh Steelers. You think they're going to beat the Titans on Sunday? Yeah, unfortunately. All right. I don't know why Number it would be unfortunate. Number two seed will be the Tennessee Titans. All right. Number three seed will be the Miami Dolphins. You think the Dolphins are going to get it done, do you? Yeah, number four seed going to be the Denver Broncos. Right. Then we're going to have the Colts as the wild card, the top wild card. Your favorite team, right. Yeah, except for Tony Dungy. You don't like Tony Dungy still. Don't get me started on that. He's such a nice man, had such great success. What's not to like about Tony Dungy? Goodness gracious. Listen, I don't have time to talk about that. Okay, I'm sorry. I broke your... The Baltimore Ravens as the next wild card team so the patriots completely outside of the playoffs and so by that i assume then you're saying that the ravens are going to go down to dallas this sunday and beat them you cut that right wow that's a big call i thought dallas is playing great football so that would mean by what you just laid out there indianapolis colts their first round game would be at denver that's a 42 to 10 win for the Colts. <laughs> 42 to 10, they're going to go into mile high. Listen, I don't agree. I don't disagree. I think that the Colts would win that game, and uh, you know what that then would mean, right? That if the third seed won their game, if your Dolphins that you just predicted beat the Ravens, that means the Colts. Well, that's not going to happen. The Ravens will beat the Dolphins. I well, Those I have wild card teams will win in the first. Wild card round. I happen to agree with you, as a matter of fact, Ed. That's We're a, on the same ticket. That's right, the same page. And uh, I think that, uh, but, it, if, but if it doesn't go that way, if uh, the third seed wins their game, it would be the Indianapolis Colts at the Pittsburgh Steelers. What about that? To that? We're getting to that. Oh, we are, okay. Because the second round will be the Ravens playing Pittsburgh in Pittsburgh again. Ooh, tough game. Ravens have already lost to the Steelers twice, right? Yes. They're not going to lose a third time. Oh, bye no. Bye, Benless Burger. <laughs> <laughs> Why does that give you such joy? And by the Ooh. way, I know I've told you this before, but his name is Roethlisberger. Yeah, well, he's gone now, so we can't talk about him. So the next game is the Titans are at home against the Colts, and the uh-huh. Colts crack them. Really? Okay, so I can AFC see that. The AFC Championship game is two wild cards, Baltimore at Indianapolis, and you know what happens. No, I don't. What happens? Colts, 36, L- Ravens, 17. 36 points. You know, there is a logic there, the Ed. You you, you uh, don't sound completely screwy on this one because the Colts did already destroy the Ravens. It was early on in the season. The Ravens seem like they're just about as good as anybody. And uh, the Col- the team that doesn't impress me, i got to tell you, the Ed, is the Colts. I know they're on this uh, winning streak and everything, but they but uh, they're so unimpressive. It doesn't. Well, well, how are the Steelers impressive? Tell me. Getting these magic trick wins and stuff like that. That wasn't no touchdown. Of course you know it was. It. Of course it was wasn't. a touchdown. Of it, course not. It was absolutely a touchdown. They should have called it the way it was on the field. This instant replays for just, I don't know. But anyway, listen, and then they won a couple other games. And then everybody cried when they lost to the Colts. Oh, yeah, they lost to the Colts because the Colts cheated. Oh, the Peyton man, he's not the best in the world. Well, yes, he is. He's first team all pro this year again. Well, I don't, and he's just, been hurt. He's got, he's got a bum knee that got operated on twice, and he didn't miss no games. That Benless Burger, man, he's he tough. hurt his hand. Oh, I twist my hand washing my knee with some soap. Oh, I got to <laughs> sit out the game and let Byron Leftwich play. When did that uh, happen? What are you talking about? When did he miss the game? He missed one half this season That's in spite of the fact. Yeah, he was in the locker room trying to wash up and he got hurt. Yeah, but he's, well, listen, he's played dynamite all season long in spite Peyton of shoulder Manning injuries, missed, knee injuries. Peyton Manning ain't missed a snap. All right. Not well, one snap. All right, well, fine. That's great. That's a that's uh, that's commendable. Uh, that's commendable effort on his I part. I told you what's going to happen. So now we're going to go to the NFC. Oh wow, you've already got that laid out too. Go ahead. Well, the number one seed will be the New York Giants. Mm-hmm. So they'll beat the Panthers in uh, in the Meadowlands this week. Okay. Yeah, it's going to be super duper cold out there. Mm-hmm. All right, they don't like to travel north. Number the big two game. seed right. will be number two seed will be Carolina Panthers. Mm-hmm. Number 
three seed will be Arizona Cardinal. Really? Oh, the Cardinals have been uh, not looking too great over the well, last Well, they won a division. they got to be number three seed. They don't have to be. Well, the, the Bears and Vikings ain't catching them. Well, the Vikings, if the Vikings win out, they're not only uh, going to do that, they have a good chance of getting a bye in the first round. Well, they're not. They're going to be bye, bye, bye because they're going to be the fourth seed. They're winning that division, but they're number four. Okay. Number five will be Atlanta Falcons. Mm-hmm. Number six will be Dallas Cowboys. Oh, so the Cowboys are still going to get in even though they're going to lose. So what you're saying is the Cowboys are going to lose at home to the Ravens but then go up to Philadelphia the following week and win there. Yep, and sneak right on in. Wow, I said this is interesting. What you, uh, the way so you the have the first round games will be Dallas Cowboys versus Arizona Cardinals in Arizona. Ooh, that's a good one. Dallas Cowboys gonna win that game. I I would agree with you if that's the way it goes. Okay. Then the next one will be Atlanta Falcons at Minnesota Vikings. Mm-hmm. Falcons, both wild card teams are gonna win again. How about this? This is some playoffs. Very exciting playoffs this year. So then we got the next round. Mm-hmm. Dallas Cowboys go to New York Giants. Ooh. You know the Dallas Cowboys got that number. It's over for the Giants. Well, I don't know Dallas if I would Cowboys say that. Cowboys go to NFC Championship, and Atlanta goes to Carolina. Man, you know the NFC South, all of them teams win at home, so Carolina's at home against Dallas in the NFC Championship. Wow. You know, by the way, Carolina has not lost a home game all yeah, season long. No. Yep. That means they've won all eight games. When you say eight, no, that means that they, they've won all eight games? Yep. Oh, okay. All right, great. Good to so know. The NFC Championship... Final score, 24, 22. And which team has which number? Tony Romo, back to pass with five seconds left. <laughs> uh-huh. Picked off, Carolina Panthers go to the Super Bowl Ooh. against the Indianapolis Colts. Mm-hmm. And the Colts win the Super Bowl, 26-20. 2620. Well, it sounds like we have a great uh, postseason awaiting us here, right on the other side of uh, of the holiday season. Wow, that was really great. Uh, very colorful description too. The Ed, good for you. Hey, uh, wh- you know, by the way, you just did an impression there. Why don't you? You, you were calling the play by play. Why don't you give me one more treat here? Why don't you do? Who's your favorite uh, broadcaster? You know who I do hate. Who's that? Dan Deardorff. You don't like him. That guy, and he's always, every time he does a Colts game, they lose. I wasn't aware of that. I didn't know that uh, yeah. that, that was uh, some sort of a Colts curse. are like 6-52 and 52 when he does their game. 6-52. and 52. He's done that many Colts games. Well, do me a favor, because uh, rather than uh, are trying to articulate why you don't like him, why don't you just do an impression of Dan Deardorff so we can see what uh, what isn't good about him. I'm the worst announcer in history. I don't know what I'm talking about. And, uh... I used to be an offensive lineman. I got too many hits when the people went around me, and I'm in the Hall of Fame for some unknown reason. <laughs> that doesn't sound like Dan Deerdorf at all. I knew that's who you were talking about, though. See? You knew it. All right. Okay, so the ad. So we now know that the Colts are going to beat the Panthers in the Super Bowl. I've heard uh, more ridiculous ideas than that from you. What about, uh, let's move on to college football quickly. I have up, I'd really appreciate, as a matter of fact, if you would join in on this, the ad. And if you win, you will absolutely win a bevy of prizes that we have. Go on to uh, to 710ESPN.com, the Damashek uh, homepage there, and you can find our college football mania contest going. You can win all sorts of nice prizes if you win this thing. So, uh, yeah, I uh, signed up, but I signed up for somebody else's on accident. So i got to sign up on yours because yours is the official one. Yes, that's correct, yes. Because yours is the... Uh confidential one yes confidence pool yeah 34 bowl games and you have to pick all 34 the one you're most confident in you well, give your 34 Tech minus five against mississippi well we're not even involving the spreads it's straight up winners well then that's even better that's the number one championship game right there well Ole miss is pretty good yeah they beat four ah, they're nothing no okay well you're gonna but bottom line is you are gonna you are gonna sign up for this i look forward to